This is Adobe Voice. You do need to have an account to use this product. My students have been using their Google accounts that come from the school district. When you're in Adobe Voice, the great thing is, is it has icons that are built in and it does a Flickr search for public domain, Flickr and Pixabay for public domain. So if I wanted to create a story, I'm going to say it's going to be travel. I can choose my own template. I'm going to make it my own. And then you can see I pick, can pick icons or photos or text. So if I pick icons, um, it will come out with Creative Commons license icons. Sorry for the cat. And I can use any of these things and they will be properly attributed at the end. But say if I wanted to use something instead of instead of this, I could put a photo. And it's going to look for, again, public domain images using Flickr or Pixabay. So I really like this image of a an airport. And I can resize it if I like, which I do because it's this way. And there you can see the source at the top. From, uh, the Basel Airport. So this was one really awesome tool that you can use with your students. Also what you can do is add some sound to it and also music as you can see at the top. There's a bunch of different songs that you can also use. There are different themes that you can use. But again it's one way to get students again to use images that are Creative Commons.